Hey guys, we're here to I'm back with another video, and today it's going to be a little bit of a change in pace because we're not going to be talking about COD Mobile today. We're going to be talking about this game, which is Standoff 2. So, I played this game a couple months ago, and I'm now back into it for a few days, just kind of checking it out. And I gotta say, guys, it's super, super fun. So, let me talk about this game. So, this game is basically a clone of Counter Strike Global Offensive. On your iPad. Now I know there are games like Critical Ops too. That game, compared to this game, a lot different. A lot different in the visuals, a lot different in the gameplay, and this game is is pretty damn fun. So there are a few things that I like about this game. One is the settings. I love how everything is so organized and how it just it works so well. Like I have high on everything, probably the best except that I don't have the the answer tropic filtering on but basically i run a solid 60 no lag no drop nothing so they're doing extremely well in optimizing the other thing i like is the customization in your controls so when you go to customization this is my setup right now this thing is awesome i don't know why other games don't do this small little thing maybe there are games that do i the games that i've played don't have this and that is if you look on the top left the shooting zone i am able to disable the fire buttons in this game and have a shooting zone so anywhere i press in that little zone which i can move around you know as much as i want to make it smaller or larger whatever that's where it's going to shoot and i love that so much because you don't need to rely on a button if you miss the button or, or or something you know so really really like that not too many buttons compared to like fortnite fortnite is just i mean it's a completely different game but I'm just saying, the amount of buttons in that game, like, it's just so disorientating sometimes. But anyways, anyways, so there's that. Now, there are a few things I don't like about the game. Oh, yeah, also, there's a USA South server, which is where I am, so really like that. But there are a few things, or there is, I guess I could say, two things I don't like about the game. So one, it's been out for a while, but there's not too many features, but I'll get to that in just a second. Number two are the maps. The maps are so freaking small. It's just, I don't think it's good at all. I, I'm pretty sure that they just have those maps for testing. If those are actually maps for this game, like, that are going to stick, that's going to be a problem because the maps are way, way, way too small, especially for a competitive that's coming out soon. Now, going back to the first thing I was talking about, this game doesn't have too many features. I mean, there are skins, and I do got to say, guys, the skins, the weapon models in this game are the best I've ever seen on any mobile game. Look at this. This looks freaking amazing. If you actually go to the shop, there are a few cases you can get. So if I go to this one, we're going to look at this skin. Look at that. It looks gorgeous. And this game, I don't know how it has such high quality models for weapons, and yet the game doesn't lag. And yet there are games that like Full of Force, which the, we the models aren't as nice, and the game still lags sometimes. So... You can definitely see where the optimization comes in. Um, and then you can also you can also sell your skins in the marketplace. So if I wanted to buy this knife that someone got, you can actually pay with gold, which you buy with real money. So, pretty interesting. Exactly, exactly like CSGO. Now, they did put up um, back in February 1st. So, not too long ago, they posted sort of their plans for 2019. and Or at least what they're working on right now. So right now, they're working on ranked matches. So... Yes, competitive is coming. It's in test mode right now, so in the next coming months, we'll see that very soon. Um, we'll also see a transition in the server connections, because I do notice it is right now um, from client to client. So basically, it it connects to someone else's internet. So if their internet's bad, the whole server is very bad. So they're going to, you know, rework that. Um, just basically new UIs in the main menus for just to, to better choose the modes. Um, there is a friend system in the game, but there will be a clan system, and with that system you can invite people, and whoever's in your clan, you can actually custom make a custom match just for your clan members, so you guys can practice, which is very cool. Um, the other thing is, um, there will be a trading system for skins, so you'll be able to trade your skins with a friend, or if you want to do giveaways or something, you can do that. So, um, there'll be new maps, new skins, just a lot of new stuff that are coming to this game, and I am... Very, very excited. Honestly, I'm very excited for this game. 
to really shine. It's so far, it's really fun. Uh, just the maps are very small and it's more of just kind of, for me playing this game, it's more of just like testing the game, you know, uh, until the real things come in. So um, I do have some skins already. I mean, as you guys see, I got these skins just from opening cases from, I don't think I bought any gold. I think just by playing, um, you get these blue credits and with these blue credits, you can actually buy these cases. So I ended up doing that and I got a few skins, which is pretty nice. But anyways, um, I'm gonna go and hop into a game, just kind of show you guys the gameplay, just showing you, you know, what's the game is, what this game is all about. If you guys have not tried it yet, and then if you guys would like to see more, definitely let me know. But uh, without further ado, let's get into it. All right, guys. So we just got into a game a little bit late, but gonna be playing some team deathmatch. I was gonna play defuse, but those those modes are really really long, and I mean like really long so i might do that for a separate video if you guys like to see just like a full um gameplay of that but for now i just want to kind of show you guys how i am with this game and just show you guys the game uh and i thought team deathmatch would be kind of the shortest all right that was totally my bad to rush that but i'm gonna go ahead and switch the gun anyways we're gonna go m4 Let's do it. What? All right, we're fine. We're fine. Give me that triple, dude. This is what I mean by the maps are too small, dude. Like, look at this. I'm. We can literally go in their spawn here. And they're just going to keep spawning. We can literally spawn trap if we wanted to. The good thing is that there are many ways to get out of their spawn. But, so, oh wow. I did not see that guy get out of there. Got him, buddy. Just making sure you got him. Oh my god. I just looked there. I will say, man, it is kind of, uh, not gonna lie, it is kind of annoying that, that when you crouch, like, if you're on crouch and you spawn, it, you'll still be crouched when you spawn, like, it's, it's, and it makes it really slow, so you don't realize it until, oh god. Oh god, let me get out of here, man. I gotta reload. You gotta really have a good aim, dude. Oh my gosh. Give me one second. Make phone calls and stuff. What are you doing, dude? What if I. Oh, wow. This happens a lot. I will say. And I, it's not my internet, it's, it's the connection to the host. Which kind of is. What are you doing there? Kind of sucks, but again, they're gonna be working on that. Just keep in mind that you will probably see a lot of that. All right, you guys are gonna go upstairs. Excuse me. Just gonna rack up all these kills, dude. Oh my god, dude, you're blocking me! You're blocking! I gotta say though, right now, my favorite gun in this game is the M4. It's just really manageable recoil with good damage. Oh boy. Oh my god. I'm getting phone calls like crazy, man. Give me a second. Wow! That's alright, we're winning. By four right now. Ah, oh, I thought that would be a headshot. Wow! Headshots are so, 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 so deadly in this game. Oh god. 
Totally shook that. Oh, let me get it! Let me get it! Oh my god. Thank you. Can I get out, please, here? Wow. How did he not die from that, man? Jeez, we hit the 100 mark. Jeez, man, these headshots are nasty. Okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, these guys could catch up. I'm not gonna lie, they they could catch up. That place is so easy to headshots on them. God, dude, that guy actually shot me. Oh my god, I totally screwed that up. Ooh, there are times where we really just gotta... We really gotta practice in this game, man. And I have not practiced too much. I'm just keeping like a steady aim every time. I know I saw him over there. Like, just doing that each kill, like consistently, that's the trick for this game. Can scare the hell out of me. Nice. All right, 30 seconds left. I'm pretty sure that's gonna be a win. Oh wow, you're still invulnerable. Wow. 20 seconds, and I'll take that as a victory, man. Wait, let me get the last kill or something. There's one. Oh, okay, there you go. Most eliminations. I gotta start from that. Nice, where did I go? 52 kills. My god. There you go. Leveling is extremely slow in this game. But you do get some credits, though. Usually each game. So I actually got double coins right there. So, anyways... Uh, that's the game guys. Um, it's super super fun. They're still working on it, but let me know what you guys think. If you guys like to see more, definitely let me know down in the comments. And uh, I'll catch you guys in the next one.